Welcome back, everyone. Let's see what we've got working on today. Yep, you guessed it. Chevy Express van. So this is an 05, and I'm not sure how many years these are the same, but this is just a basic LS, uh, 2500 Express van. And you have a burned out headlight. Well, how the hell does that thing come out of there? Well, I'm about to show you. But first, that's the bulb you need, okay? The H6054, okay? There's a few ways to tell these are burned out. Obviously, it doesn't turn on. Um, otherwise, I don't know if you can see down in there, but you can see all that crap. The bulb itself, as you can see in there, exploded. So, yeah, that means it's bad. But, these are super easy to change. So, on the bottom, you see this indent, that indent, and on the top, you have that one and that one. Okay, well, there's just little Phillips screws in there. So, I'm going to go ahead and take this out. Um, you can see this chrome trim. That's actually the trim ring that holds that headlight in. So, I'm going to go ahead and pull that out, and I'll be right back. Okay, so you got your light hanging there. Um, you just pull that connector off. But you have to be careful because as you can see, one of my retainers broke off. They're just barely spot welded in there. There it is. So I'll have to get a new one of those, but for now it'll go back in without that. Okay, so if you're quiet enough, You can hear it bouncing around in there. It bounces around pretty good when you blow those. Okay, so here's our new one. You're just gonna pull this little thing off. Plug it in. So we got it plugged in. Now we put our trim ring back on. I always like to put the top screw in first. It's a little easier. Um, the bottom ones, when they fall, because you're gonna drop them, they'll typically fall straight down. So you don't have to try to find them or anything. But you can see that when that bulb is in fully intact right there So we're good there. So I'm gonna go ahead and get this trim ring put on and I'll be right back Okay, there we have it I typically do this one second because it's so simple to get in That one's not bad either And then your adjustment is right here if you need to adjust them If you need to adjust them in that's what you do right there and then this one is your up and down. All right, so there you go. Super simple. Took me less than two minutes to do this whole thing, but I kind of got to, you know, draw it out a little bit for, you know, the video. But anyways, like, subscribe, comment, questions, leave them down there. But anyway, from Iowa, it's still freaking cold. Deuces.